coming at you from Soap Opera Spy, your number one source for daytime soap spoilers, updates, and more. Hi, General Hospital fans. It's AM from Soap Opera Spy with all your hot soap news. Before we get started with your General Hospital spoilers, kindly press the subscribe button below and turn on notifications to make sure you never miss a video from us. Great news today, GH fans. We have your next two week spoilers, and it looks like there's going to be a lot of excitement coming our way. We're going to see a grim fate. Obviously, Curtis Ashford after he got shot at the Metro Court. So, we're going to find out what's happening to him. We're going to see exposed secrets a date night, and a villain's return. So let's start diving into it and see how it all shakes out. General Hospital spoilers for the next two weeks, that's July 7th to July 28th, reveal that any main, aka Ned Quartermain, will come through for Leo Quartermain once he starts to act out. Poor Leo just can't understand what's going on with his stepdad. Harrison Chase will hunt Hetty down to help Leo join the week of July 17th to July 21st. So there'll be some sweet yet awkward moments where Eddie plays the guitar for him. It could help Eddie see that maybe Ned's old life wasn't so bad after all. As for Anna Devane, former WSB super spy, she'll be determined to use herself as bait. Dante Falconeri will insist on being Anna's right-hand man as they set a trap for the person behind the recent Metrocord threat. Meanwhile, poor Sasha Gilmore will land in a situation where she has to undo some of the damage. Could Sasha make some other major mistake at Deception, or could her recent shoplifting drama leak to the press? We wouldn't put it past Gladys Corbin to intentionally leak that news just to make sure it becomes an issue for Sasha when the court makes a decision regarding her guardianship. Gladys just isn't going to let Sasha get control of her finances again. She needs her money for her gambling habit. Regardless, Sasha seems to be on the verge of another serious spin-out since Gladys will ultimately be rattled. Poor Sasha, it just seems that the writers write her into one disaster after another. Nina Reeves will also race to the hospital to support someone, so that may be Sasha. Elsewhere, Molly Lansing Davis and Christina Corinthos will tackle some complicated feelings about the surrogacy and what they both truly want. Over with Esme Prince, she'll be on a mission for answers. Since Allie Mills will return as Heather Webber, Esme may turn to her biological mom for some information. During the week of July 24th to July 28th, Dex Heller will find something ghastly. It sounds like Dex will discover a body, so I'll have to report back to his boss, Sonny Corinthos, and ask, what do I do? In the meantime, Sonny will stumble across a confrontation, so that could be one between Ava Jerome and Austin Gatlin Holt. It's about time that Ava started fighting back and we see the old Ava we expect. Ava will make a huge confession and will owe someone an explanation. So Sonny may find out the mess with Nicholas Cassadine, last played by Adam Huss, and Mason Gatlin's threats on behalf of his boss. There's a chance the body Dex finds will belong to Mason. We can only hope. So Sonny may help Ava and Austin with their next round of drama. Sonny will deliver some new orders to Dex following his body's discovery. So Dex will probably have to get his hands dirty. And we just know Joss isn't going to be happy about that. Unfortunately, Ava will have another reason to be concerned later. So this isn't over for her. Mason and Austin's boss could make an appearance in Port Charles if the situation escalates enough. At Pentonville, Drew Kane will grow suspicious of Cyrus Renault's motives and will ultimately interrogate him. It's about time that Drew realizes that Cyrus is only out for Cyrus and not to help Drew. We'll see Drew back Cyrus into a corner and try to find out exactly what his deal is and what he's up to. Next, Elizabeth Baldwin and Hamilton Finn will enjoy a fun date night together, so Violet Finn should be pleased. Other GA spoilers say Carly Spencer will give Jocelyn Jack some important updates. So maybe she'll stick to her decision to move out of the house and downsize to a smaller place. Maxie Jones is looking for a larger home. So maybe she'll eventually buy Carly's house and offer her old apartment to Carly and Donna. 
As for Portia Robinson, she'll do the best to console someone. That could be Curtis Ashford if he wakes up paralyzed and struggles to cope. Whatever the case, Portia will find herself taken aback, so Curtis might end up pushing her way and rejecting her help. Back with Nina, she'll somehow manage to impress Willow and take the next steps towards bonding with her. We know that's only a matter of time that that's going to blow up. When Nina runs into Carly later, she might stick to her promise to play nice, though her SEC tip-off secret will linger in the back of her mind. Finally, Laura Collins and Valentine will carry out their search in Chechnya, so they might run into some surprising obstacles along the way. General Hospital spoilers say some shockers and shake-ups are ahead on the ABC soap, so you make sure to stay tuned and stick with us for all the up-to-date sizzling GH spoilers. Make us your top General Hospital source by pressing that subscribe button below, turn on notifications, and if you like our video, give us a like by pressing the like button. See you next time.